Recently, Tesla has been consistently revealing new versions of the Optimus robot, each one looking more refined and stylish than the last. From the first simple black and white prototype to the matte black one, the golden variant, and even the black and red Kung Fu Optimus that appeared at the Tron AR red carpet event, Tesla has shown that it is not just testing technology but also experimenting with design and personality. But despite all those models, none of them is the premium Gen 3 version that Elon Musk has been talking about for months. According to Musk's repeated confirmations, we will finally see that upgraded model next month at the Tesla shareholder meeting. This new Optimus is expected to feature an incredible redesign with major technical advancements. It is said to be the one that will truly bring the dream of a home robot to life, a machine that can cook, clean, and perform highly complex tasks with human-like precision. Tesla has put extraordinary engineering into this project, especially in the hands of the robot, which Musk has proudly described as being the most advanced in the world, second only to human hands. Elon Musk even hinted on X, saying, wait until you see what Tesla does with Optimus. Now imagine this. You return home after a long day at work, open the door, and hear a calm robotic voice say, dinner is ready. Please enjoy. Sounds almost unreal, right? Well, Elon Musk just made that scenario possible. The latest Optimus upgrade can actually cook. Yes, the Tesla bot that once could only walk and do simple movements can now prepare meals from start to finish. It can recognize ingredients, cut vegetables, cook food, and even serve it beautifully. It can take orders and deliver food just like a delivery driver. This is the kind of future people imagined in science fiction, yet it is happening right now. Sure, it might replace a few jobs, but it will also create entirely new ones. And if you love discovering these futuristic breakthroughs, make sure to hit that subscribe button to join the Amp Drive family. We bring you the most thrilling updates about Tesla's technology, and trust me, you will not want to miss what's coming next. Now, back to the story. The race to build the world's best humanoid robot has never been more intense. Three big names are leading the charge, Tesla, Unitry, and Figure AI. Unit's G1 has shown incredible flips and martial arts moves in its recent demos, while the Figure 03 has just been revealed, setting a high bar for competition. This puts huge pressure on Tesla. If Optimus Gen 3 fails to deliver something extraordinary, Elon Musk might lose the lead in this robotic race. So, what exactly makes Optimus Gen 3 so special? Musk said, we are finalizing the design of Optimus version 3, and it will be a very remarkable robot. It will have the manual dexterity of a human. That means hands capable of performing the most delicate and complex actions. Musk described the Gen 3 version as the most beautifully designed and balanced robot Tesla has ever built. Compared to version 2.5, the new Optimus is nearly a complete rebuild, refined for harmony, symmetry, and a friendly human-like presence. Tesla understands that people do not want a robot that looks threatening or mechanical, they want one that feels approachable and relatable. Based on leaked reports, Optimus Gen 3 will have a digital face display with Grok AI voice integration, similar to Tesla's in-car assistant. This means the robot's face can express emotions, display information, or even communicate visually with users. Essentially, its face will act as a living interface, part expression, part display, and part control center. The body has also been redesigned to be lighter, more flexible, and faster. Tesla aims for a walking speed of around 3 miles per hour. To achieve this, engineers are believed to be using lighter materials, new actuators, and improved joints that reduce overall weight without compromising strength. One of the biggest upgrades in Optimus Gen 3 is the boost in its degrees of freedom, the number of joints and movement axes it can control independently. This determines how fluid, natural, and human-like its actions can be. While the previous Optimus version could perform around 1,500 basic tasks, the Gen 3 robot is expected to manage close to 3,000, doubling its functionality. This leap in capability comes from better sensors, more flexible joints, and a more advanced control system. For example, if Gen 2.5 could pick up an egg without cracking it, 
Gen 3 can now crack the egg, cook it, and serve it, mimicking real human actions almost perfectly. This generation focuses heavily on real-world usefulness, especially for household chores. Its upgraded battery will reportedly power it for up to 22 hours straight after just a two-hour charge. Naturally, this means the earlier dream of a $20,000 price tag is no longer realistic. Making a robot this capable requires massive resources, particularly in designing the brain and hands. Elon Musk openly admitted that creating truly dexterous robotic hands was one of the hardest challenges Tesla had ever faced. Producing those arms on a large scale, he said, is 100 times harder than building a few for prototypes. Musk even confessed that developing Optimus was tougher than the Model X, more complex than the Cybertruck, and even more challenging than building a Gigafactory, but not quite as wild as creating Starship. Musk explained why the hands are so important. Humans evolved to have hands that can manipulate nearly everything around us. Every tool, every object, and even our homes are designed for human hands. So, if a robot is meant to live and work in our world, it must move like us, especially its hands. He often calls the human hand an evolutionary masterpiece, with over 27 degrees of freedom, powered by tendons and forearm muscles working like strings of a puppet, precise, strong, and incredibly versatile. Those hands allow us to swing a baseball bat, sew a button, play piano, or fix an engine. If robots are to coexist with us, mastering this level of dexterity is essential. This is where many robotics companies struggle. They can make robots that run, jump, or perform stunts, but not one that can peel an orange or rinse vegetables underwater. Tesla's focus is different, it wants a robot that performs the simple but meaningful daily tasks humans do. Cooking, for example, is a perfect test. Making something like bacon and eggs requires understanding timing, temperature, and coordination. You open the fridge, find ingredients, pick them carefully, heat the pan, and control every movement precisely. For a robot to do this, it must combine intelligence, perception, and mechanical grace. If Optimus can truly cook, that means it has stepped into our world, not just an industrial one, but a human one. Tesla's factory robots can weld car frames with speed and accuracy, but they work in controlled environments. Put them in a real kitchen, and they would fail instantly. Optimus, on the other hand, is being trained to adapt. Musk once said, it can be a teacher, babysit your kids, walk your dog, mow the lawn, fetch groceries, serve drinks, whatever you imagine, it can do. To appreciate how far Optimus has come, we need to look back. When Musk first unveiled it in 2021 at AI Day, people laughed. It was just a person in a robot suit dancing. But one year later, Tesla showed a working prototype. It was clumsy, but it worked. By the end of 2023, Optimus Gen 2 could walk faster, fold clothes, hold an egg, and even dance smoothly. Then, in 2024, it officially joined Tesla's production line, helping organize batteries and assist in assembly. Since then, the focus has been on making it truly useful beyond factories, ready for homes, offices, and even hospitals. By next year, Tesla expects Optimus to perform a much broader range of tasks. Musk said it might take until 2026 before it can handle almost any daily activity you ask it to. The reason is Tesla's advantage in real-world AI, the same intelligence behind its self-driving cars is being used for Optimus. Tesla combines expertise in motors, batteries, and electronics with a deep knowledge of structural design and large-scale manufacturing. That's what gives it an edge over competitors. Imagine waking up to a perfectly clean home without lifting a finger because Optimus already handled it. It picks up trash bags, wipes tables, folds laundry, and even cleans kitchens. Earlier versions could also serve drinks, check packages, water plants, open doors, and even chat casually. However, the biggest weakness so far has been its walking speed. It still moves too slowly and sometimes looks stiff, like it is wearing a heavy suit. Tesla's goal is for Optimus to eventually walk at 5 miles per hour, but it is still not there yet. 
What makes Optimus truly revolutionary is how it learns. It can watch videos of humans performing tasks, say, someone cooking or cleaning, and then train itself in a simulated environment, repeating those actions billions of times until perfected. Once ready, it transfers that skill into the real world. That means in just one day, Optimus could learn up to 100 new tasks. From vacuuming to complex assembly work, its skill library keeps growing fast. But then came some shocking news. Mark Benioff revealed that Optimus could cost between $200,000 and $500,000. That announcement sent waves of disappointment online. Many fans had expected it to cost under $30,000. At such high prices, Optimus becomes something only the wealthy or large corporations can afford. Imagine an average family trying to justify buying one, it would cost more than a luxury car. This led many to question whether Tesla's dream of a robot for everyone is still alive. The reason for this price jump lies in the robot's complexity. Musk once said that while some parts like the AI computer could be shared with Tesla cars, most of Optimus's components are built from scratch, motors, actuators, sensors, and electronics. There is no existing supply chain for this yet. Tesla expects to scale up slowly, with 1 million robots per year not possible until around 2029 or 2030. Until then, each unit will be expensive, possibly 100,000 for Gen 2 and over 200,000 for Gen 3. Eventually, once production reaches scale, the price could fall to around 20 to $25,000. It still sounds high, but if the robot can work 22 hours a day, every day, it might actually be worth it. Compared to paying human labor over years, it could even save money. The AI chip alone costs around five to $6,000, and each arm contains 26 actuators. This is not just a gadget, it is a masterpiece of engineering. Still, if any company can make such a product affordable, it is Tesla. Just like they transformed electric vehicles from luxury toys into mainstream machines, they could do the same with humanoid robots. The integration of AI will make the robot even more powerful. Once Optimus's hands become advanced enough, Tesla plans to connect it with large language models. That means you could simply say, hey Optimus, cook me pasta and pour a drink, and it will do it perfectly, choosing ingredients and even searching recipes online if needed. Picture walking into your kitchen and seeing a robot cook with elegance and focus, as if it had been trained for years. This moment would mark the true beginning of human-robot coexistence. Of course, many people worry that robots will take jobs, but history shows otherwise. When ATMs were introduced, everyone feared they would replace bank tellers. Instead, the number of tellers increased because lower costs allowed more branches to open. The same may happen with Optimus, creating new industries and job types in robot training, maintenance, AI programming, and design. Healthcare is another field that could benefit greatly. By the year 2050, over 16% of the world's population will be above 65 years old. The demand for medical staff will far exceed supply. Optimus could become an essential assistant in hospitals, delivering medicine, helping patients move, checking vitals, recording data, and even detecting early symptoms using AI analysis. Robots do not get tired or emotional, and they can handle tasks continuously without fatigue. These machines can go into dangerous environments, boost productivity, assist the elderly and disabled, and even take part in rescue missions during disasters. Tesla's Optimus stands at the heart of this transformation, marking not just technological progress but a shift in how humanity lives and works. By taking over repetitive and hazardous jobs, it can increase efficiency, cut costs, and allow people to focus on creativity, empathy, and innovation. With all this said, the question remains, what feature excites you the most about the Tesla Bot Gen 3? And how much do you think it will cost when it finally reaches the market? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed this deep look into the future, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to stay part of the journey. Until next time, this is Amp Drive, thank you for watching.